In season one of Game of Thrones, George Martin, the author of A Song of Ice and Fire, wanted his prop head on a pike, but due to budget limitations, they couldn't afford it back then. In a recent podcast, Ryan J. Kendall promised Martin that his head will be seen in House of the Dragon. The Iron Throne is greatly redesigned from Game of Thrones. It is larger and asymmetrical to more closely match the description in George Martin's novels. With almost 10 million viewers, House of the Dragon's pilot was the most watched series premiere in HBO's history. The original Game of Thrones series also saw a huge spike in streaming data in the weeks heading the premiere of this show. Social media marketing campaign for the show started in April 2021. During the Iron Anniversary, HBO's official 10th anniversary celebration of Game of Thrones, filming for the show started around that time as well. Only five days after the initial airing of the pilot episode, it was announced the episode reached viewership numbers of around 20 million across all official HBO platforms and the show was renewed for a second season. Steve Toussaint auditioned for various roles on Game of Thrones. The narrator at the beginning of episode one is actress Emma Dorsey. Like its parent series Game of Thrones, House of the Dragon portrays many of the characters as older than they were in the source material. King Viserys is portrayed as an aging man with graying hair. As reported by Deadline in December 2020, Danny Sapani was in talks to play Corlys Velaryon. The role would end up being cast with Steve Toussaint. Series creator Ryan Jakendall was set to produce a live-action series based upon Conan the Barbarian, with Miguel Sapochnik executive producing and directing some stories.